Trinamool Congress that has raised the issue of fuel price hike today in the Rajya Sabha, leading to a massive uproar. While the center has reduced the excise duty on fuel, it also raised other taxes, which means that there is no change in the fuel prices for the Aam Admi. Surging date routes have been stopped by the Indian Railways. This is causing a lot of hardship to the people there and this is making a mockery of federalism. Because the passengers, as it is, are facing a lot of hardship because of the rise in fuel prices, petrol and diesel. So the railway is the only option, sir. And by doing this, without consulting the state government, Minakshi Bhanja tracking this story for us. Minakshi, this was kind of expected, isn't it? That the angst of the common man will be articulated in Parliament and Derek O'Brien, I'm given to understand, has raised the issue very vociferously in the Rajya Sabha. Well, Afrida, the opposition is uh, mounting its, uh, uh, is upping its ante against the government on this particular issue. But uh, one thing would be well advised for all opposition is to perhaps uh, keep the pressure on, uh, because we have seen in the past even the Congress Party uh, raised this issue. We have seen Ajay Mahan uh, organize a signature campaign uh, in each petrol pump across Delhi and subsequent uh, to that uh, campaign, submit those signatures to the government. But that apart, like right. you pointed out, uh, Derek, uh, today the TMC uh, has raised the issue uh, in uh, the upper house. They are seeking for the government's intervention. Uh, but the opposition hmm. uh, also, uh, Afrida, raises this issue from time to time in spurts. There, there, there is no right. consistency uh, to, to the campaign by the opposition. On the other hand, we've had statements uh, from the government as to how in the foreseeable hmm. future, very soon, Afrida, uh, fuel prices yes. uh, will get brought under the ambit of the GST, which is the only solution hmm. to the Gustav Yes, and until that happens, Minakshi, what we see is that the government is time and again tinkering with the fuel prices and, you know, of course, uh, designing a, a revenue model of sort that suits the government, but that is not suiting the common man. And what you're telling us is that the opposition uses this issue but does not sustain the campaign. Did I get you correctly? Absolutely, Afira, you've hit the mm. nail on its head. Uh, we have seen mm. spurts of momentum from the opposition in the past, uh, as we, uh, we saw it today uh, in the upper house play out, but there is no consistency to the momentum to the opposition's right. demand uh, for government intervention. On the other hand, the government is on record uh, to give an assurance, even to Mirren now, Afira, in an exclusive conversation, mm. that eventually uh, this will happen. But when uh, the timeline, they're not able to speculate on because they say that there are other stakeholders mm. Like the other states who are a part of the GST Council, who have to be willing to give their share of the uh, fuel revenue up uh, in order for it to successfully right. go through. Right. right, there is a consensus building that is necessary at all levels, at the state level and also among the political parties. Thanks, Minakshi, for giving us your inputs.